Hello everyone, uh, my name is Kogul Visunul and I am a second year PGDM student at SPGMR Mumbai in the marketing specialization. So today I will take you through a typical day in the life of an SPGMR student. So currently I am going to my class. Uh, uh, so I have a subject called sales and distribution management where we were allocated pre-reads yesterday. So after reading all those, uh, now we will have the class discussion today on that particular topic. So I'll be going for my class right now and I will take you through all the visuals and all the activities that is going on at SPGMR on the way. So yeah, let's go. So I'm currently leaving my hostel room. Uh, there are multiple uh, hostel blocks at SPGMR. And I am in the B27 block uh, of the you know, SPGM uh, hostel complex. Uh, I have to rush the test. So yes, now I have finished with my classes. So we had only a couple of sessions today and uh, it got winded up in the afternoon. So sometimes we will get sessions like this where we'll be free a little early but sometime it will go till night like 7 6 50 pm so i'm going to, uh, to the mess to have some food and later on i will take you to other parts of uh, spjma where i will show you the multiple facilities that we have also i think let's go through the entire day in such a way i will show you the places around the experiences that we are getting here so for now we will go to the mess and let's see what we'll have uh, for the lunch. So yes, uh, we are done with our lunch. I will show you a special place uh, here at SPJMR. So this is actually our Abhyutaya Center. So people who know SPJMR actually knows what Abhyutaya is. It's a mentorship program that we have for children from 6 to 12 standard. So Abhyudaya is basically uh, our non-classroom uh, learning program which is actually credited course and uh, for a one year of time we have to mentor uh, people from different stages of life like uh, won't be the same uh, financial or economic standards as like ours uh, and uh, will be in a different stage. So there will be people from 6th standard to 12th standard, basically students from 6th standard to 12th standard. So it's coming under that umbrella program of Abhyudaya and we are basically having different um, activities like home visits and also some engagement activities in the campus and we are actually mentoring them for uh, like one year so just the office that i have you know covered now is the abhyudaya office and i think right now the summer camp is going on because most of the students have uh, a vacation right now now we are coming back to the acad block and i'll show you around in the acad block area So I'm back in uh, the Acad block. So this is the you know famous purple wall over here. There's another big wall over the other side. If people are posting a lot of pictures at SPJM, mostly the background will be uh, kind of this kind of a purple wall. So I just wanted to show you that. Now we'll be going to our GAN auditorium. Like this is the old auditorium at SPJM. Uh, I don't have the access now to go inside, but I will just show you the outside part. Let's go and see like, how the you know, group activity rooms or classrooms looks like. So currently I am in the lift and let's go upstairs to see the classrooms as well as the group work room. So right now I am entering uh, the group work room area. Since it's an afternoon and uh, it's the start of a new week, I don't expect much people to be here. Yeah, I don't see a lot of people here. So yeah, this is the group work room. So this is the place where, you know, if you have any academic assignments or something, people will come and sit here and do a group talk to, you know, come to a arrival of a solution or something. And currently, this is not that crowded, but if you have any submissions or any deadlines coming up, it will be really crowded. And there, we have another, you know, group space for the work as well, which is called the reading room. But as you, as you might have noticed, 
it's not like a place where you can you know, talk loudly and you know interact with each other group members that vividly like you can do in group work room but yeah the reading room will also be used for these academic purposes okay now i've reached the other block which is called the d block and in the intersection of d block and c block we have a uh, our cafeteria where we will hang around in the breaks so i'll show you our cafeteria which is which we call the 2.5 bistro so i will take you there so i have already shown you like what my class looks like that's my marketing class right now which i have shown earlier now i'll just show you a typical classroom where like uh, usually the first year classes will and uh, uh, will will happen and also some you know if you are having a higher batch size this will be uh, this classroom which will be used so like i mentioned earlier now we are entering the reading room yeah this is also a group work space here we can come sit and walk but as i mentioned this is kind of relatively low noise area and uh, they will try to you know, stick on to some casual normal discussion rather than like going out and out discussions with their group so yeah this is how the reading room looks like right now i'm in front of the library we do have a lot of collections lot of subscriptions and uh, some of them are accessible on our personal uh, id as well i mean the spjm or id that we get but other things you have to you know get it through the library itself so right now after this we'll go to the bistro where we will spend a lot of time usually in a typical day getting some snacks or juices so let's go there okay, so right now we are out of the academic block now the place that you see behind me is the mandir that we have in the bhavan's campus since spjmr is inside the bhavan's campus which actually have a lot of other colleges like uh, a junior college there's an engineering college so different kind of institutions are here in the campus so this is one entity that is uh, in the bhavan's campus which is like applicable to everyone so this is the mandir uh, that is seen behind me and now i will take you to the bhavan's ground where the actually the cricket ground is uh, they are in the bhavan's ground so we do play cricket some sort of football also at this bhavan's ground we do have another ground uh, near our hostels that i will eventually show you when i go to my hostel uh, so now we will go to the bhavan's college ground so this is the bhavan's ground uh, this is the you know, biggest playground that we have in the campus so it's proper it's a proper cricket ground and have a pitch over there where we actually used to play and we can also play football in in the in the leftmost port, par, portion of this particular ground after the term started the new term started uh, i haven't been here but i think we we have we do have a match coming up against the other program so i am in the pgdm program so there's another uh, program called pgpm where uh, people with more than 5 years of work experience you know having their program running so we will be shortly having a match with them now let's go directly to the hostel side so yeah just on the way back to the hostel uh this is somewhere that uh, most of the spjm students will spend at least some time during their hectic schedule so this is the bhavan's lake uh, behind me so and we do have a lot of chairs on the way this is actually a payment which will go to the hostel so actually after a tiring day coming back uh, to the hostel through this way will give you some sort of relief and we do spend some time sitting over the in the benches and you know watching uh, the lake so the buildings that you see behind me as are the hostel blocks on the way back i do have another thing to show you so we have a bio park here uh, which is the pavan's nature and adventure center so here we do have a lot of animals like the peacocks dogs and so on everything so this is where uh, the entrance is but now it's closed we can't go inside and behind me is the 
graffiti wall that we have prepared as a part of Forges. So Forges is our, our national level cultural and management fest and uh, we had our theme this year as graffiti of glory. So as a part of that we created this wall over here and yeah I just wanted to show you that and on the opposite side here we have the B29 ground. So now I am entering the hostel complex. This is inside the B29 hostel and this is the common area. So like I mentioned since it's an afternoon no one's here but if it's uh, evening or something it will be flooded with people. They'll be here for some group works over here and also they will play some games like foosball, table tennis and you know pool over here. Currently inside the night candy, which we call as Shilu. This will be only be opening after 5 pm. So it will go on till 2 am in the morning. So after a lot of projects or you know free reads, we do come here at the night to have some coffee, tea or some snacks. It will be open till 2 am and it's right directly beneath uh, my hostel block which is B27. So now, yeah, we have done two for the day. I think I have covered, I was able to cover almost all the parts of SPJM and what we actually go through. Now let's go to my room and take some rest. Okay, now I am back in my hostel. So I just, at the very end, I'll just show the amenities hostel also. So we do have uh, you know, washing machine and the dispenser, water dispenser, and then fridge as well here. So this is applicable for all the floors in the uh, hostel building. So I am, as you can see, I am tired also, and I am back at my hostel. It's time for some rest because after that we have to work on various aspects. We have, we do have some readings for tomorrow. Also, we have to work on our CVs at the moment. So since we are having our autumn internships coming soon, so we have to prepare for that. This is the end of this video. I hope you liked uh, uh, this particular video where I, I was sharing with you my typical day and you know what we actually experience you know day to day on a day to day basis at this video. So yeah thanks for watching and uh, do subscribe to the channel and uh, stay up to date with all the news from the MPO. Thank you. Have a nice day. Bye bye.